Hi there. Hello, Prescott YMCA folks, and especially Silver Sneakers folks. It's Janice, the instructor who is missing you the most at this time when we are all at home being safe and staying healthy. I would like to give you a 30 minute class today that will have a lot of the Silver Sneakers um, type benefits for you and we'll be doing some cardio, some leg strengthening, and some abdominal work. It'll be a 30 minute class. And believe it or not, this is my first time posting live in a video. And even though I've been teaching for 20 years and teaching silver sneakers for nine years, it's a little daunting. So welcome, thank you for being here. All you need is to have a chair, your water on the chair, and have space around you. As you can see, I'm in my garage. This is where I have the most space. So find a place where you're able to do some movement and be safe with your surroundings. And I'm gonna start the music. Here we go. Let's march right left. And if you'll stand behind and to the right of your chair, that way you'll have space to move side to side and front to back. So I'm gonna be in front of my chair so I've got the room here. March. March wide. Tap and shoulder shrug. Think of lifting your chest, pulling your abdominals tight. Roll your shoulder up and back. Elbow up and back. Step and heel dig, left heel and right. Think of reaching the top of your head toward the ceiling. Heel to the side, press out. Toes and back, press front. Lengthen through your spine. Heels to the side, press out. Just getting the blood flowing, getting our bodies warmed up. Step and curl, elbows back, shoulders down. Step and knee, press down. Hand curls, swing your arms, nice and easy. Knee, elbow cross. Double knee left, double right, again, four more doubles, three, two, and march wide, march in, and wide, and in, out, out, in, in, right, left, right, left. Push your arms right and left. Four more. And tap, reach up. Any shoulder issues, keep your hand below shoulder height. Reach across. And march, knees up high, march wide, march in, march wide, march in, inhale, open your arms, exhale down, and roll your shoulders up and back and down, jump rope, lift your heels, tap your toes, Lift your heels, tap your toes, and heels, and toes, march right left. So I'm backwards, of you being backwards, and I'm backwards, so I think you're on your right foot now. Tap, reach up, watch your shoulders, reach across, reach up, reach across. Step, touch, swing your arms.
knee, elbow across. March out and in. Two, one, two. Optional, push your arms side to side. Right, left, right, left. March in place. Inhale. Exhale down. Roll your shoulders up and back and down. Feet hip width apart. Hands to your thighs. Toes and knees point forward. And squat your hips back. Two counts. Exhale up. Abs in. Glutes are tight. Torso long. Make sure that your knees aren't going past your toes. Keeping your chest lifted. Protecting your knees. Protecting your back. You don't have to go down too far. Singles down and up. Eight. Straighten all the way up. Squeeze your glutes. Lengthen through your hips, through your spine. Four more. Three. Two. Three counts down, one up. Slowly lower, lower, up. Again. Slow, strong, and controlled. Up. Two more. Down, down, up. And breathe, breathe. One count down, three up. Slowly lift. Again, and down, and slowly up. Two more. Again, breathe, and exhale up. Singles, eight, make sure you're breathing. Seven, six, exhale on the count, five, and four, three, two, one, march in place. Inhale, open your arms. Exhale down and roll your shoulders up and back and down. Take stock of how you feel, how your breathing is, how your heart feels. On a scale of one to 10, a five would be moderate intensity. You're breathing a little rapidly, but you're not overexerting. So we wanna stay somewhere around that five for you at home today. Keep your feet moving while you get a drink. And then we're gonna do some leg strengthening exercises. I'll try to get my sides correct, right, left. I'm not sure what to do. Just do one or the other. Okay. So here on the left side of the chair, stand close enough to hold on with your left hand, weights on your left leg. Bring your right knee up. Doesn't have to be high. Two counts. Straighten your leg and bend. Add strong. And if we do too much standing for your left leg, right leg, Take a break. Join back in when you're ready. Good. Again, slow, controlled. Extend and hold for three, two, and bend. Again, hold, two, bend. Two more. Three, abs tight, bend, and hold, and bend. Now tap down and up for eight. Practice balance if you choose. Reach the top of your head toward the ceiling. Good. And four. Three. Almost there. Two. Straighten your leg and hold. Last seven. Six. Good job. Four. Three. Two. And march. Nice work. Go around to the other side of your chair. Standing, holding onto the chair with your left hand. Standing on your left leg. Right knee is up, here we go. Two counts, straighten and bend. Think of pressing your left heel into the floor, holding your right knee with abs strong, reaching the top of your head to the ceiling. Extend and hold, two, bend. Again, hold, bend. Two more. Good, again. And breathe. Tap down and up for eight. Balance challenge if you choose. Nice going. Four, three, two, one more set. Extend and hold for seven, six, five, three, two, one, and march. Good job. Come back over to the left side of your chair. Wherever you've got space behind and to the right of your chair, step and curl. Marching left, right. Gonna loosen up your quads. 
should feel about a four or five in terms of exercise intensity on your quads. And march. You're gonna pick up your water and move around to the front of your chair and have a seat gracefully. Lean to the side for support to put the water on the floor. We're gonna do a little bit of core work. So scoot forward in your chair so you're sitting up tall. Abs are in, arms crossed over your chest. Turn your torso to the left. Inhale, exhale. So twisting from the waist, tightening through your core. Good, and left for two, center, and right. Twist right, left, and hold. Three, two, center, that way. Three, two, one. Contract your belly in as you hold. Pulse, exhale, and hold, hold, center. Singles, twist, and center. As you twist to the left, lift your left foot one inch up and down, then right foot. So that lift of the foot is gonna help you contract your bum muscles deeper. Breathe. Exhale, inhale. Four, good. Three, two, hold your feet, hold your torso, tilt down to the left. Exhale up, tilt down to the right. Dropping rib cage to hip bone, keeping torso long and tall. When you come up to center, and right. Good. Tilt left and hold for three, squeeze, up, that side, three, two, up. Feel your abdominal contraction, pulse, squeeze, breathe, and right. Nice going. Singles, left end up, and right. As you tilt left, lift that same foot up one inch off the floor, then the other. That's your balancing, your stabilizing leg that you're lifting when you're working your abs harder to control your movement. Hold down to your left, three, two, up, hold right, squeeze, foot barely off the floor, and left, hold, two, up, and right, breathe, two, now, turn to the left, two counts, and center, turn to the right, and center, tilt down to the left, breathe, exhale up, tilt down right, let's do it again. Turn to your left, inhale, exhale, turn right, breathe, breathe, tilt down to the left, and exhale up, tilt right. Good job, hold here, hands on your thighs, and focus at your core, squeeze your belly in, and relax. Exhale, inhale, think of what it takes to pull your belly button towards your spine, contract the abs in, deep breath, exhale with each movement and pulse, squeeze, three, two, one. Again, it might be hard to feel this movement. Try to focus at your core, belly button pulling in, torso lifting long. One more pulse, three, two, and singles. Lift your left foot one inch off the floor and right foot. So you're barely lifting the foot. Again, contracting your abs more deeply. Four, three, two, and pulse your left foot up, hold, hold, down. And pulse, hold, squeeze, breathe. Two more, hold, good. And last one, hold, hold, good job. And march in place here. Inhale, reach your arms wide. Exhale, lower your arms down. And roll your shoulders up and back and down. Step out to the side. And lean to the side, get a drink of water if you're ready for one. And then make sure you're supporting yourself as you lean to the side to put your water down. Make sure it's out of the way. And feet a little bit wider than hip width apart. Feet under your knees, toes and knees point forward. We're going to practice lifting up out of the chair in a squat. We're going to go up slowly and then come down as low as you can without touching down. Abs are strong. You choose how low you can go down after we come up. Eight counts. Here we go. Exhale. Breathe, breathe. Four, three, two, and eight counts. Sit your hips back. Don't touch down, but get low as you can with good form. Knees over your ankles. And eight counts. Exhale up. Good. 
Breathe, breathe. It's hard to go slow. Make sure you're squeezing your glutes and sit back. Nice job. Holding here as low as you can safely support. Two counts partway up for two and down. You don't have to go as this slow. Go to where you can support your abdominals, support your back with your abs. Good. Exhale. Almost done. Hold here. Three, two, all the way up. And hold for three, two, up, two more. Hold, breathe, up, and hold, hold, up. Nice job. March left, right. Move behind and to the right, left of your chair. We're doing everything backwards, but you're doing fine. I know you figured out what I'm doing. We're going to do some more cardio. Just some movement, loosening up your body, getting your heart rate up. Tap, reach up. Again, not too high. Protect your shoulders. Reach across. Reach up. Make sure you've got room on both sides of you. Reach across. Step touch. Swing your arms. If you don't have a lot of room, make these movements smaller. Just do what you can. Double step and touch. Circle and curl. One, two, three, curl. Good. Again. Larger movements to work harder. Keep going. Nice work. Knee, elbow across. Four more. March out and in. Push left, right, left, right. March forward and back. One, two, three, and back. Two, three. Two more. Last one, we'll do that whole sequence again. Double step and touch, circle and curl. Two, three. Feels good to move. Lengthen your spine, deep breaths. Little change this time. Knee, elbow across, single, single, double. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. One more, single, single, double. March out and in, push, right, left, right, left, right. Keep your torso up as your hips go low. March forward and back, circle and clap, circle and clap. Two more. Nice going. Squat to the right, left, hold, hold, squat, step together, and hold, hold, together. This side, hold your squat, feet together, and right, hold, hold, together. Good work. If you want to keep your squats in place and not go side to side, that's fine. Two, together. Now tap, reach up. Reach across. On the other side now. Reach up. Reach across. Here we go. Double step touch. Circle and curl. And back. Make sure you've got room. Be safe. Pick up your feet. Two more. All right. Reach for your heel in front. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Again, single, single, double. One more set. Single, single, double. March out and in. Right, left, right, left. One more. March forward and back. One, two, three, and back. Arms optional. Circle cup and back. Two more. Nice going. Let's do it again. Double step touch. Circle and curl. And back. Breathe, breathe. Shoulders down, abs tight. Good, again. Listen, reach for your heel and back. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Again, single, double. 
One more. And double. March out in. Push. Right, left, right, left. Feel that music? March forward and back. I feel a twist coming on. You're going to let yourself loose, right? Two more of these. Breathe, breathe. Show me your best twist. Yeah, it's okay to feel weird. We're all looking great. March in place. Deep breath. Inhale. Exhale down. And roll your shoulders up and back and down. Nice work. Move over to the left side of your chair here. Holding on with your right hand if you need to. Feet hip width apart. Heels up and down. Going right into some more leg strengthening. Exhale, inhale, hold the chair or not as you choose. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Two. Heels up and hold. Pulse. Three, two. Down. Again. Three. Down. Two more. Good. And again. One more set. Singles. Breathe. Eight. Good. Seven. Six. Four. You want to twist, don't you? Hear the music. Two. And one. Good. And march. Nice job. We're going to move forward in front of our chair so we can have a seat gracefully and get a drink. And then we'll stand back up again. So trying to keep your heart rate slightly elevated, but make sure you're getting your water. Lean to the side to put your water down. And feet hip width apart. Two counts, squat all the way up. Exhale, and down. Good. Lots of squats, right? Why is that? Because it's a functional exercise, helping you to get up from a chair, up from your bed, in and out of your car. Strengthens those large muscles, so we can do our daily work. Hold down, stay here for three, two, up, again. Hold, breathe, up, almost there. Hold, two, up, good. And last one, two, up, and march. Come over to the left side of your chair. Holding on with your right hand, standing on your right leg. Lift your left leg to the back, and then feet together. And reach to the back. Flex your ankle, torso long, reach and back. Good, and again. Now lift your leg to the side. Any hip problems, any injuries, do what your doctor says. If the doctor says no side lifts, then you're just gonna lift to the back again. Exhale, ankle stays flexed. Breathe, breathe. One each way, lift to the back. Exhale, good. And side, lift. Good, nice control. Practicing balance if you choose. And so, there was a phone call that we were letting go. Where will we lift to the back? You should do four of these to the back and then four of these to the side. Hold to the back, last set. Three, two, together. Hold side. Three, two, together. Hold back. Three, together and side. Hold and together. Good job and march. Come around to the other side of your chair. Make sure we're even on both sides doing the same thing. Start off standing, holding. Left hand on the chair. Weights on your left leg. Torso long. Abs in. Right ankle flexed. Lift to the back. Two counts. Reach back and together. Keep your hips stabilized. Shoulders above your hips so you're not leaning. You're activating the glute and your hamstring. Good. And breathe. Keep the ankle flexed. Leg to the side. Two counts. Lift. Three. And together. Good. Exhale. Don't lift too high and keep it slow. Stay in control. Good. Now each way. Two counts. Lift and back. Reach the heel. Together. And side. Breathe. And back. 
and side. Good work again to the back. And side. Almost there to the back. Make sure we're balanced on both sides. You do the same number on each side. Lift to the back and hold. Three, two, together. Side and hold. Three, together. Back and hold. Together and side. Hold, hold. Good work. Step wide and circle your hips. Loosen everything up. Breathe, breathe. Circle the other direction. See, lots of you are commenting. My phone is too small. I can't see what you're saying. But thanks for being out there. Shift your hips side to side. Maybe a little attitude. All right, let's march. We're going to come forward to your chair. Gracefully have a seat. Lean to the side to get a drink. We'll do a little bit more core work. And then we'll do some stretching as our heart rate slowly starts to lower down. So lean to the side, and everybody stand up. Coming over again to the left side of your chair. We're going to do some abdominal crunches by twisting your torso, bringing your knee across, or bringing your knee up. So right knee up to the side, left knee, good. So you're tilting your torso down and breathe. If you want, you can have your elbow reaching down to your knee to remind you where you're working. Tilting from the waist. Single counts. Eight. Seven. Good. Chest is facing forward. You're bringing your knee up to the side. Four. Pulling your belly in tight. And you don't have to lift too high. Left knee across. This knee, two counts. And straighten. Good. Crunch and twist and open up. Make sure you're turning from your waist, not just bringing your elbow across. And breathe. Good. Singles. Eight. Going to work at your core. Torso is long. Six. Good. Four more. Three. Three. Two. One. And march. Go around to the other side of your chair. Pulling on with your right hand. Left hand standing on your left foot. Right knee is out to the side. Right elbow tilting down. As your knee comes up, two counts. Tilt and lift. Good. Breathe, breathe. Two more. Good, again. And singles. Eight, seven, And four, good focus, deep breaths. Exhale, inhale, left knee across, right elbow, and open up. And exhale, inhale. Two more. Breathe, nice going, we're almost done. Singles, make your contraction strong. Eight, seven, breathe, breathe. Four, three, two, and one. Good work. And march. Inhale. Exhale. And roll your shoulders up and back and down. Now march half speed. One and one. Take your feet a little bit wider. Tap and sh shoulder shrug. Take it slower. Roll your shoulder back. Good work. One more. Two. One. And hold here. Move over to the left side of your chair. And we're going to do a quick cool down and stretch. We change the music. Get something that's a little slower. Thank you all for being with me today and for your patience as I figure out how to do the live streaming.
we go with that nice, easy, cool down song. So standing on the left side of your chair, sorry about that, you're gonna step your left heel forward, sit your hips back, lengthen through your spine, reach your chest forward, gently stretching all the way back, hamstring and glute. Keep breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. And other leg forward, sit your hips back, pulling your hip away from your heel as your ankle is flexed. And step that foot closer. Left leg back, press your heel to the floor, and reach your chest forward, straight line from heel up through top of head. Make sure you're squeezing your shoulder blades together and back. Now lift your heel and lean your torso back so that you're bending your knee and pushing forward through your left hip, lengthening the distance between your rib cage and your knee. And step your foot closer, right leg back. Press your heel down, reach your chest forward, keep your torso long. Now lift that back heel and lean your torso back and push your hip forward, stretching the flexor and quad. And bring your feet together. Put your right hand on the chair and step your left foot behind you and lean to the side, either left arm up and over or arm in front to stretch through your left side. Lower your arm down and move over to the right side of your chair, standing on your left foot, step your right foot behind and lean to the side, arm up and over or arm in front, stretching through your right oblique. And lower your arm and step to the side. Let's move to the front of the chair and have a seat. And as we hold here, inhale, reach your arms wide. Make sure you're sitting tall in your chair. And then exhale, bring your right arm across your body, press your shoulders down, and turn them up to the right. Inhale, open your arms wide. And then exhale, left arm across. Gently pull your arm over to the right and turn and look to the left. And inhale, reach wide. Exhale, arms down. And inhale, roll your shoulders up and back. And exhale, down and around. And one more deep breath, inhale. And exhale, down. Go ahead and lean back in your chair and let your body relax, hands resting on your thighs if you choose. I want to thank you all for being with me today, and I'll be posting some more videos, and hopefully you'll enjoy them and they'll be helpful for you. Please make sure you're taking care of yourself during these strange times that we're in. Stay healthy, reach out to those that you know. Um, many of you are on my Facebook page from Prescott YMCA, and I love hearing from you and knowing that you're doing well. So reach out to others, stay healthy, keep moving, and have a wonderful day, folks. Thank you.